we'll <laughs> we'll we'll play the video, Lucas, and then you can. I need your you know, opinion if it's changed. So mm -hmm. on and so forth. All right, let's play it. So here's the uh, here's the video. Let's let's see the debut. No, we're not going to play any sound just in case there's copyrighted music, but we'll react to everything here on the video. Okay, oh, so the sound is the best part. Okay, but I, I don't want. All right. Let's Oh, maybe there is. Yeah, you're both right. <laughs> yeah, well, we're there. too late now. Oh, sir. Please. Oh, my gosh. Classy. This chapter will be defined by a sea of Honolulu blue and silver, the way it was meant to be. Inside the four fields that's bursting at the seams, one pride shows up. Inspired by yesterday's heroes, handed off to today's. Oh my gosh, getting chills. But it doesn't matter where we suit up. When we punch in, we're gonna rep our town. There's no doubt. This city is who we are and what we play the for. all white. It's oh Detroit versus everybody. In every stadium, every game, every snap. Hold on. Hold on. This is where we get real, boys. Buckle up, boys. Sure, it gets real clots. I'll be Buckle in. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Beautiful. Oh, they're getting like cinematic with this. This is a big deal. Yeah, it is. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. City needs Buckle a hero. Up. Oh, shit. Oh! 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 The NFC North, the Black and Blue Division. Oh! Mm, okay. To be king, oh, the can Black. Only be one. We'll be the one with more grit, more attitude, more drive. Black. That foot always Face on the gas. Oh. After all, this is the Motor City, and we are the Lions. I mean, Boy. I'm speechless from that, dude. That is unbelievable. Best in the NFL. Oh, my god! I just want to run through a wall. I, I, I want to order the black, so fast. the black alternates right now. I should I honestly, I wish I should order them yesterday. All right, I need those right now. I need a same brown, all black, uni. I even want the helmet. The helmet's sweet. Yeah, Dude, was, that's helmet. what did it for me, boys. I, I know, and this is what I said about the black jerseys, and I still will stand by this comment. I said oh the, the outlining around the numbers should have been white. That's the one. That's the one. You, you thing don't where... have to nitpick anything. You could say these oh, were I great am. jerseys. I am. Why do we have to always jerseys. nitpick? Why can't we, we are... say these are? Can you let? Can you let me finish this statement, Boone? No. Let me no. finish. Let me no, this finish. is a beautiful. This is a beautiful moment for the Detroit Lions fan base. No nitpick. It's gonna come full circle. It's gonna come full right, circle. Come on, come okay, circle. all right. Give it time. Let it breathe. Let it breathe. On me. All right. Go so when I saw those helmets with the black face mask with Panay Sewell with the black pants, fellas, it's it's doomsday. It's doomsday in Green Bay. It's doomsday in Minnesota. Wherever they wear them. It's a funeral. I will say this though, Gentry, those all blue ones, you you were talking out your neck earlier. Those I think are my favorite ones, Gentry. Those Beautiful. all blue ones. And I got a question: Are those so like those are their main home and away jerseys? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> New oh, jerseys yeah. completely. Yep. Real mm -hmm. quick too, I want to throw this out there: the helmets, not just like the blue helmet, but the them the taking the mat. the gray the helmet. Mat putting the blue on it and then keeping that blue stripe, but putting white around it. And then the black or the blue helmet doing a black face mask with the actual lions logo. That is just an unbelievable, like whoever did the helmets, whatever happened with, they absolutely killed it. Like the helmets changing the face mask colors and, and doing that, putting the white stripes there too, changed the whole thing. Like these, this is unbelievable. Great job for whoever did it. Shout out Thank Sheila you. Hand, Rod yeah. Wood, whoever did it. <laughs> I do think when they wear the blacks, they should wear the black pants, though. I don't, yeah. I don't know about the blue. I would pants. hope so. Blackout, a blackout. Be, I, if they wore them with like the blue. They, that shit the would blue, be gross. The blue pants don't look terrible, but like the black pants just flow so well with the black jerseys. And I wasn't saying that I like 
hate the blue ones. I just said the white and the black ones are better, in my opinion. Well, with a oh, new jersey, with a new uniform, new helmet, you're getting away from that SOL. The best part of this entire jersey or uniform has nothing to do with the colors. It's getting rid of that stupid ass, all due respect, William Clay Ford patch on the jersey. Thank God they they threw that in the garbage. No more William Clay Ford patch on the uniform. The jersey, the everything is sweet. I love it. I love the helmet. I love the design. It looks modern. It kind of has an old feel to it. And now you, mm, you guys know what I say, what, what Prime said. He's, he said it a lot of times. When you look good, you feel good. When you feel good, you play good. When you feel when you play good, they they pay good. So they're gonna play. You talking? You pulling up at Ford Field or on the road in the all black unis? You you're wearing black to a funeral, fellas. That's what they're gonna do. They're wearing all black to a funeral. I absolutely love it. I, I'm so happy. Dan Campbell came out that he asked Rod Wood for black jerseys or black uniforms or really just black jerseys, and Rod told him go win that division, and he did it. So here now the fan base has- like a black uh, jersey. So let's go. I, love I posted it. today too. Dan wearing the the black when he was in Detroit. So it just it's all full circle a little bit for him. Um, I I love these u- uniforms. Though. I think like today when it got released, um, it sucked. It got released and it was a little underwhelming because fanatics obviously like when the players wear it, it looks a lot different than like a fanatics just like their their ad like the picture of the ad for it. So everyone, it seemed like some people were like, hey, I don't know, it's not the best. All the black, it's not the greatest. They could have done this that. The, the video that came out and the way that they did it and the, with the pants, I don't think there's a stripe on the pants anymore, just just strictly just plain white, plain blue. Um, the whole design of the jerseys and, and the helmet designs with it, at all three phases of it, unbelievable how they did it and what they did. Uh, I think they killed it. I'm excited. I cannot wait till next year. This is like literally, guys, when I say this, like the Booner Path and the brand new Lions, this is exactly like – this is a refresh for the brand new Lions. The SOL is out there. I was in arguments all day today on Twitter with SOL crowd. <laughs> SOL is gone. They, like this, this is the very, very end and the last part of the SOL. We are moved on from that. We're going to win a Super Bowl next year. Brand new Lions are here. Brand new jerseys. Brand new helmets. Brand new everything. It's a whole new football team. Now I, I'm, 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 I'm just, I'm overwhelmed with excitement right now. The Booner Path is, is, is just glowing it's, it's unbelievable not gonna yeah. lie i was i was a little nervous too when i first seen the pics but then you you had to wait for the pants and the helmet i think the helmet the black or the black and blue helmet was really like the biggest takeaway for me that yeah. that helmet is fucking sweet i think they killed see the black lines logo mm. yeah like mm. Mm. I was I was a little I, paranoid though when I first seen the pics. I was like, they have to have the right pants. Maybe the helmet switch up. The blue face mask too. Like, there's so many yeah. little details about it that make them sweet. Yeah, the blue face mask. I had to double check because because face masks you don't really like sit there and, and remember a ton. So I went back and looked at the old jerseys and and they, it's like a clear difference. They changed the the stripes on the helmet. They did everything. They yep. They went all out. They did a good job. It would have been cool. You know what would have actually been cool. And now this is not me nitpicking, Klotzy. Like an all white helmet would would, be, would have been sick too. I think that would have been really cool. I I love I love the blue helmet. I just I love they did it. I think they did a great job. You could probably nitpick and and say, well, there's certain parts that you could probably. I don't you know like Klotz brought up the outline numbers. It could have been white. Like overall, they're they're gonna have differences opinions about how it should look. But just looking at it, I love it. I absolutely yep. love it. I don't care what people say. Oh, you want to be the Panthers? I mean, suck it. You know who cares? These are sweet. The Lions needed an update on their uniforms. They got it. They got it. Looks sweet, absolutely sweet. And this brand new era of Lions football. And I don't. I mean, okay, players. If the jersey looks sweet, they love it. They're already a good football team. The end of the season, you're not going to look back and be like, wow. You know, because they wore the black, they they won two less games. Like, no, no, who gives a shit? The, the jersey I hate is going to make people feel good, good, but yes. it's not going to affect anything on the field. Uh, it, it may be confidence. You feel cool, right? You you feel good. But let's be real here. Like, the, the whole crowd of, oh, they're bringing back the black. Well, I remember when they last wore black. It was rough times. Well, I don't know about you, but it was rough times for my, most of my lifetime and most of many people's lifetime. So 
That has nothing to do with it. I love it. They did a great job with the jerseys and in the uniforms in general. They they crushed. Yeah, it it feels like like they could have done like a little couple subtle changes and just kept kind of the same jerseys and done a couple switch ups here and there. Um, for this one, it, it does feel like they said we're we're rebranding this whole thing. Like we we have a whole new regime here. We have a whole new like the whole brand new Lions thing. Like we're doing a complete upgrade. We're gonna redo everything, and that's what they did. Like they redid the pants, the helmet, the jersey. They just did a full full like this is different from what we've ever seen. This is a whole new De- Detroit Lions. Like that's what I love about it as well. Because I did hear yeah. people around the city being like, "Oh, is it just gonna be like a subtle change? Is it gonna be something small? Is it?" And then today when the fanatics thing came out, people were like, "Oh, it's just a subtle change." No, like when you see the full jersey, this isn't a subtle change. These are brand new uniforms oh, yeah. across the board. There is th- th- there is maybe some resemblance, but th- just it's just the colors probably. Like th- that's the resemblance I can see. Everything else is different. This is a whole new whole new uniform. Yeah. I do wonder when they're going to actually debut the blacks and like what they do for Thanksgiving because they, obviously they always wear the old jerseys for that day. They're keeping like, retro. Do they, do they bring them out that day or like when do they bring them out? But I'm excited to see. It's it's confirmed. I'm pretty sure they're running same retros as usual for Thanksgiving. Same retros, yeah. Because they I they mean, did what? put a link on they put a link on their Twitter, and you, if you want to go to that, Jeff, and on their Twitter, that link that they did, um, it's like on with their pictures, and when you scroll, it's like a whole page explaining like the meaning behind each each piece of the new jerseys, um, and then it did say there was the retros were still there, and it said I think Thanksgiving, so I think the damn they're still. I hope they wear the blacks like divisional games. Oh, against yeah. the Packers. Prime time. You Monday know. night football, Sunday night football. 49ers. Wear the blacks against versus the Cowboys. 49ers. Wear yeah, the blacks no, against the Cowboys. I think you can only wear the the throw or retros or not retros, the alternates like two or three times a year. There's like a limited time. Cowboys and 49ers would be my two picks. If it's two, yeah. Yeah. when Stafford comes, two. Stafford comes back this year. That'd be a good one. There's a couple yeah. of them. It's a funeral. They already put it. They already put him in a funeral, though. I mean, he literally saw God probably after that one day. Yeah. When he the well, in the back look at, but fellas, look at this comparison. Um, we put this on our on our X account. Go follow know. it at official CT Pod. But you see it right. And if for all podcast listeners, uh, you got to go pop over to YouTube eventually and check out what we're looking at here because it's the old versus new, the kind of the blue jerseys. Look at that. I mean, it's just it, it leveled That's up. Exactly- that's exactly what I wanted. Like, tell me that that Hutch jersey. It looks like this one with Barry, and that's like yeah. exactly what I was asking for. It looks they, sweet. They pretty much just threw it back. with the blue face mask, the mm-hmm. black numbers. I love yeah, it. The, the lettering even looks so much better. Just looks clean, I'm, man. Clean. I'm so hype. I've never been this hype in my life. I think. I think this is like a new. <laughs> you, you're just seeing a new booner here, man. This is unbelievable. I think and I just you- I just opened up a whole new world in my life. <laughs> Yeah, they cure, this cures depression. Uh, what are the Lions coming out with new uniforms? This is why. I mean, look at this. Look at this. I mean, th- this as well. The 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 whites. I mean, you could just mm-hmm. tell. Look at the whole design. I know. The I saw the doc. The pass. doc bringing up the the dots within the number. That's a fair. I'm not in love with that, uh, but I don't care. It, wait, like, wait, else. wait. I don't think that's actually like going to be on the jersey. I think that's just like yeah, the match. I think- or like yeah, the type like of- when the oh, okay. shoulder pads were like yeah, okay. it's probably just to breathe. Like Remember if you want to pull up, bro, they get like sweaty as fuck. You just yeah. see the sweat. Yeah, you know what? Everywhere. Scratch whatever Jeff, I just said. If you yeah, want to pull up my it. tweet, I put out my Maybe. tweet there with some of the pictures, and I'm sure you could see if there's dots because the jerseys you could just see the numbers in that tweet. I'm sure there's no dots in them. I bet you you can't even notice it. I could be wrong. Maybe I'm wrong, but I don't think you can even notice it. To be honest. Not, yeah, here's here's that. Let's um, let's check that out. I have it right here. Okay, this is the the uh, Jared Goff in the uniform here. Um, I don't see any dots. I guess it's well, you, you can't even. It's holes though. I understand it. I I'm I'm just yeah. an idiot. So yeah, that that I thought perfect. the same thing too, Jeff. And then I was like, ah, probably not. That's Especially why the fanatic Nike pictures. Nike, pictures. Nike yeah. jerseys yeah. are yeah. tight as fuck. You those things like this, like they suffocate you. Oh man. my gosh, I love these. Look at that face mask, man. That he face mask. The, I mean, that helmet, too. The, I, I, to what you were saying earlier, Booner, with the stripe down the center of the, the helmet. White, the yeah, blue and the white. white. Yeah. That one and the all whites with the, it just makes it pop so much. It makes the face mask more de- defined. It's it's what just such a about the, look at that. That's right. Yeah, you can't white. hate on those, man. I, How I do you not like the blue, dude? I didn't hate it. I just said I like the whites and the blacks better. 
That is that's so. Oh, there are old. dots. That is, that is so. so clean, they are dots. Yeah, man. but go to the white ones the, real quick. Yeah, I, Jeff. It, here, let's check. So this is the. Do you guys like oh. the Detroit on the front because, like, obviously in the picture yeah. it looked a lot smaller, but I still think it looks yeah. really good and it, it it fits in. It looks clean. I like yeah, it I'm because awesome. before there was nothing. It was. I think. I don't think they ever had anything. I like that they have something now. Yeah, they just yeah, had this, the NFL logo. I. I mean, old, and I get they they kept the William Clay Ford in the helmet. That's fine, but I'm talking about on the actual jersey. That's that's where it was like, gee, what are we doing? Like you could put it on the back of the awesome. helmet. That's fine. But oh, they, yeah, they, yeah. they took it off the jersey, which I'm in love with. And, and like I love this concept: the blue and black helmet, the bl- everything yeah. blue and black. Ooh. Hey, what, what's Prime say? What's Prime say, Jeff? Uh, I, what's his I, saying? I, when when you when you look good, you feel good. When you feel good, you play good. When you play good, they pay good. Mm-hmm. All right, that's how that's how that works. Yeah, and fine, they they I would I would assume these players they feel good in these new unis. It was it was the, much needed. Much the best needed. part of it is I think and, and to Lucas your point as well. Just like the details for everything, like down like even the black jerseys, you have the blue, but you also have a little just a mini gray stripe. The the helmet, you have the blue stripes, but those mini white stripes, like that makes so much of a difference on the jerseys. They have like three one three Motor City one pro, like all of that yeah. stuff. They like went down to the details, and you could tell from the last. There were people too, and. and Klotz, you kind of a little bit today, and I don't think you meant it this way, but who are like, I just want it simple. I don't want anything. But I think if you get simple, it's like the old jerseys where there's not a lot of detail in it. It's just, let's just go white, put some blue stripes on there, and let's go out and play football. These are like, you could tell there's details that make the jersey pop. Like, changing the face mask color, I don't think people realize. That's such a big difference. Like, if you hear in the video, they're like, we want to, like, we want the Honolulu blue to be seen throughout the, the Ford field you have blue face mask that just like changes your eyes you're like oh blue here we go boys like i, I, I think it changes a lot i think it changes a lot I, I really do the black face mask on the blue helmet all those details are just they they killed it with the details i think that changes this, it a lot this sounds stupid boys but do you think this like in future situations could free or could skew a free agent the lions if it's like a lions or niners and you're like Oh, sure, like, play, like, think, sure. about, like think, about, yeah, think about a guy like Stephon Gilmore, who's who's towards it. He's like, both like these the teams are pretty it. similar in talent, but no. god damn, it. like think about like remember when or okay. So, I know I like the way you're thinking, no. Klotz. You know what? Like we have a little bit of positivity no. in the room no. to here today. I'm, I'm just, I, like, I, I like wish that was true, but that is right. okay. That's where I got to throw the flag. I got to throw the like, flag. Like, I'm that. asking, like, do you think? Do you think this is a thing where it's like the teams are offering similar money? Similar talent. Well, you're looking at you're looking at taxes, yeah. weather, like family. No, you're looking at uniforms. No, you're looking at uniforms. You're looking at, you're looking at <laughs> you're looking who cares at. about their kids. Right. You want to look good on Sundays. Yeah. I agree yeah. with I agree with Klotzy. You want to look good. Right, hey. Dan, Dan Campbell's there and, and, and the uniform. I I'll come in, and listen to some Metallica, and, and put on that uniform. Yeah, you know what? I <laughs> I can't believe that. Maybe you know what? Maybe I'm wrong. Uh, you know, we'll ask if there, we maybe we'll have some NFL players on in the future. We'll just ask them straight up. Hey, imagine like we're, tomorrow, we're, Stephon Gilmore signs. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> what made you do it? Yeah. He's like, it was, it was never, it was never about my brother on the team. It was always about the jerseys. Yeah, he's like, I just want to see what kind, if they had whack ass jerseys or not. These are pretty sweet, so I'll go ahead and sign. I mean, I, it has to be a part of it, I guess. Like it, it's that would be to me is kind of like that's the salt bay, like the kind of the sprinkle on top. You know what I mean? Like, if you like Detroit for all the other things, and you're like, and they got new unis, like that has to be a little, little sprinkle. I don't think it weighs into decision making, but yeah, it helps to have sweet unis. It absolutely does. You know, but do you think they're gonna keep that um one retro helmet that they had last year? Um, that blue like Thanksgiving. Like the... You're saying? No, not that one. I'm sorry, not re- it, it is the retro. It was the, kind of the alternate helmet. It's like the blue with the uh old retro. They wore against the Raiders. Yes, I'm that blue right. helmet. Yeah, okay. do you think they still have that? I wonder if they do. I don't know. Because that, that wasn't Probably in any not. of the, the things. Probably I'm, I'm just so happy. This is this is one of the this is one of the better days in my life. I've had a lot of good days in my <laughs> life. This is an awesome one.